again guess what it's vlog 19 of my weekly vlogs where I look back I don't actually I do that on what a week that was but I do weigh myself and do a Covid test so what's the uh, weight and uh, what's my Covid test 12 stone 4 exactly and uh, positive because it's negative uh, Covid test so all good well, um, weight seems to have levelled off a bit. Um, I don't think there's a lot I can do right now to lose more weight other than not eat for a month, which I don't intend to do, I'll be honest with you. Um, Covid status, that's good. Um, as long as we can keep like that, apparently there's going to be another booming Covid very soon. So something to look forward to. Happy winter, everybody. Now, last week's vlog i mentioned i'd had a phone call we didn't go into much detail what that was about uh, what it was about was my mother was in hospital which is why i all went on thursday this week because she come out on thursday so i went to see her but she was asleep but they rang me up at the weekend asking me to agree to give her a dnr which is do not resuscitate order and i'm like what she's gone in for a water infection it turned out it wasn't water infection it was a sodium deficiency but same thing uh, yeah, yeah, we know that, but we don't think of quality of life and everything. Um, and, and I'm like, who are you, to, you don't know who she is. Who are you to judge? You've seen her ill in hospital, and you're telling me that you're going to put a DNR on her. So I refuse to give them, well, my blessing. Anyway, she comes home, and what she have with her? I do not resuscitate for her. So it's got me thinking now. Is this the way the NHS are now looking forward? Let the old people die and save money? what to give pensions out to them, what to pay for carers or whatever. Okay, quality of life may not be great for my mother, but surely to God. You know, she can laugh, she can cry, she can talk, she can have a conversation, um, she can watch telly, um, you know, she can do quite a bit of stuff. So surely that is a quality of life. It's not the quality of life I'd want personally, but it's a quality of life. So who is it? Who gives doctors or consultants the right to tell people um, that their life isn't worth living. I was a bit angry about it. I've got my head around it now, but I'm actually more angry now than I was last week. Then of course you got the Queen who passed away at uh, age 96 and uh, talked about it quite a bit on the drive home on Thursday, on the night when it happened and on what a week that was. Um, thoughts mainly go to the family, obviously. Um, it's not it's not a nice thing when a member of the family passes away, no matter how old or young they are. So, uh, yeah, quite a sad thing. Uh, but hopefully, King Charles will be a better king than what many of us have thought he would be in the past. I'm not holding my breath. Personally, life's a bit crap at the minute. I'm still trying to figure out what's going on going with the shop. Um, I should have heard something on a Friday but I didn't so I'm going to chase it up uh, tomorrow which is Monday and hopefully let you all know when I know. Um, mental health, I'm just head up all the time at the minute. Uh, can't be asked doing anything, can't be asked going anywhere. Um, so yeah, it's all a bit meh at the minute but uh, yeah, things will get better. Anyway, that's it for now. Until next time, bye.